Okay, this how-to video is going to show you how to use the um, Eagle schematic translator from within inside AllCAD Capture or Capture CIS. So if you go to the file menu, import Eagle schematic translator, we get to browse for the for the schematic file or for the STH file, um, put an output path, there's a couple of check up check boxes here for clean up and, and force labels onto unconnected wires. So if we look at the help button here, there's actually some really useful uh, information about what you need to do from a uh, translator point of view. So um, you need to make sure that the schematic is in XNL format. Uh, it's got to be a, an Eagle schematic from version 6.5 or newer. Um, and there's a couple other things. There's a few kind of choices, limitations, workarounds that you need to work through from character handling, etc., um, to make sure this is going to work. Once you've got your schematic in a suitable format, we can then browse for that file. So pick the STH file and then click on translate. Um, it pops up a log file, which kind of, this is the information that it's brought in. So you can have a look at this if you're interested. And then it's actually launched the project. So it's going to generate a new project file. So we'll click OK to that. And the schematic design then opens. And if we look at page one, there's my, my Ardinio circuit. Uh, let's just double click on one of the parts and you can see the properties that have been transferred.